Hi friends, my name is Sham and you are watching Shreya Computer Tech Channel. Friends, today is the good news for NVIDIA Shield users. The brand new Android Oreo 8.1 was released for these users. So friends, if you want to feel the Oreo 8.1 real experience, then you should follow these steps. Before installing this ROM, we need to enable three steps. Enable developer option, unlock bootloader, and the third one, install TWRP. Let us our device boot into TWRP recovery mode by pressing volume up and down and power button simultaneously. Then we have to here take a complete backup before we flash custom ROM. Select backup. We have to choose boot, recovery, system, data and modem. After selecting these, swipe right to confirm. Friends, let us wait for here a 3 to 4 minutes. When the process was finished, we need to go back to home screen. Press on back. Wiping our temporary data, it will allow us to cleanest install our custom ROM. Select wipe. After the screen appears, select advanced wipe. Select Dalvin Art Cache, system, data and cache. Swipe right to take an action. After this step, we need to go to here to install stock ROM by pressing back. Here you may find install. Select this option. Select Oreo 8.1. Friends, here I provide a latest version custom ROM and G apps which are suitable to your device. Please find in below description and you may download it. After selecting this Oreo 8.1 ROM, swipe right to install. We need to go here to install a G app version. Click on back option. Select the G apps. Friends, here I will choose the nano version of G apps. The versions of suitable for this ROM, Pico, Aroma, Stock and Micro. After selecting this, here simple swipe right to install. Before we proceed to reboot our system, we need to wipe a temporary data cache. Select the wipe cache and swipe right to wipe data. After finished all steps, we need to reboot our system. Friends, here will take 2-3 to three minutes to reboot your device successfully. And let I will show cool features are given in Oreo 8.1. Press on reboot system. 